What's up guys, it's your boy Tyus Kids here and today we're back with another Car X Drift Racing online video. I hope you guys enjoy this Car X Drift Racing online video and if you do, drop a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. This is not my livery, I found this livery in the ZML Discord. If you guys want to download the livery, the livery download will be in the description. Um, basically in this video, I did a stock S13 100 adhesion ultimate drift setup. So I'll be giving you guys the tune code, showing you guys my body kit and the full dino stand tune for the car, going online, doing a little bit of gameplay, and then we'll go ahead and wrap up the video. So first things first, if you don't know where the car is, go to catalogs, go to the Z section, and you can find the Wellington S13 right here. I'm on PC with a real in-game car name mod, so I have the real name. The real name of the car is the Nissan Silvia S13, if you didn't know. So. Once you have that done, go ahead and grab a body kit. I have the body kit right here, which is the CBW kit. I have the missile V2 front lights, the missile front bumper, the missile hood, the CBW roof. We have the CBW side mirrors, the custom performance roll cage. We have the street side skirts, the missile trunk, the RNC rear bumper, the RNC spoiler, the CBW tail lights, the slide performance exhaust, the R Corp seats, the Mono Premium Accessories and Parts Steering Wheel, the R Corp Handbrake, the Mono Shifter. For the wheels, we have this wheel in the front and this wheel in the back. If you don't know how to change your wheels, you simply press Y or Triangle to change the selection of the front and the back wheels. Um, last but not least, that's all we have. I didn't put custom tires on the car. Let me go ahead and do that now. Uh, let me see. Go ahead and put custom tires. Now the custom tires for me isn't popping up because I have it like blacked out. So I'm actually gonna brighten that up a little bit. There we go. It's gonna be proxim. Oh no, not red, not red. Hold on. Okay, there we go. We can make like the badge. Actually, I'll make the badge like a yellow, like orangish color. Yeah, like that. Okay, so. Once you have your body kit, you have the car, you have the body kit. Next thing, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the share code for the car, and then I'll show you guys the full dyno stand tune. So I'm gonna go ahead and save that. Tysk gets S13. We're gonna go to multiplayer. We're gonna go to the modification workshop. Next, we're gonna go to customs. We're gonna go ahead and go to publish for controller. The code for this tune here will be 558 All right, so now I'll show you guys the full Dino Stand tune and we'll go ahead and get into some dope gameplay. So if you guys have been enjoying this video, this far drop a like man thank you and share the video all right so first things first you want to make sure you have the stock engine if you didn't hear me at the beginning stock engine if you go and put the tune code in and it's not popping up it's because you don't have the stock engine in your car make sure you have the same engine i'm using when you use the the share code and when you use the tune it's very very important i don't know 
if you can just swap engines on like the same tune and it'll still be good i doubt it seeing as though it's like different power different uh max torques and different rev limiters so make sure you have the right engine all the time bro all right so for your suspension your front spring length will be 16 rear will be 15 front spring stiffness 105 rear 85 your front damper fast bump and your front damper bump will be at 4,500. Your rear damper fast bump and your rear damper bump will be at 3,250. Once you guys have that done, I'm gonna go ahead and move forward a little bit. Your front damper fast rebound and your front damper rebound will be at, well, no, actually they're different. I put the front, I put the rebounds a little bit higher. So your front damper fast rebound will be at 5K. Your rear damper fast rebound will be at 4,250. Your front damper rebound will be at 5,500 and your rear damper rebound will be at 4,500. Your front toe will be at negative 0 0.40, rear toe 0 0.45, front camera negative 6.45, rear camera 0 0.64, front anti roll bar 25, rear anti roll bar 25 also. Usually I run it a little bit more realistic and I put the rear anti roll bar a little bit lower, but it seems to do just fine like this, so I left it how it is. For the caster, it'll be 6.5, Ackermanigla 31%. If you ever feel like you're spinning out, turn this down. And if you feel like you're not getting enough angle, turn this up. Steering axis offset will be at 18. Kingpin angle inclination at four degrees. Max steering angle at 65 degrees. Damn, this car looks so nice. What would you guys rate this livery? 10 out of 10 down below? What would you, what would you guys rate the livery, man? It's dope. I'm gonna be doing some more like downloaded liveries. I'm, be, I'm gonna be looking for like some dope liveries to show in the vids from now on. I'll be still making my own liveries, but you know, kind of show some other liveries too, why not? For the wheels, your front and rear rim diameter will be 18. Front and rear tire width, 275. Front tire pressure 105, rear tire pressure 77. Front and rear wheel adhesion 100. Front wheel track 5, rear base 0. Front rear tire profile 35%. I'm actually going to make the front a little bit wider. We have some space there. I'm going to turn it up two notches. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Okay, yeah. Actually, I'm gonna bring the front out a little bit more. I'm gonna put it at eight. I like my cars to be wide, okay? So, it's it's looking pretty clean right now. I like that. <clears throat> For the engine, go ahead and turn everything all the way up to max. The car makes 904 horsepower with 726 foot-pounds of torque. Top speed is 196 miles per hour. Holy moly. For the transmission, it's going to be sequential. Differential type can be viscose, limited slip, or spool. It's up to you. Personally, after testing out the spool and the viscose limited slip, I honestly prefer the viscose limited slip differential. I think it's better than the spool differential. That's just my opinion, though. Let me know what you guys think. Diff locking ratio at 100. Final drive 3.75. Gear 1, 2.90. Gear 2, 1.32. Gear 3, 1.16. Gear 4, 1.06. Gear 5 is going to be 1.00 and gear 6 will be 0 0.96. All right, last but not least, your brake torque will be 3500 from by 70%. ABS, no. Launch control tandem, no. You can turn this on if you want. It's up to you, but I personally don't use it. All right, so now that you guys have the full tune, you guys are ready to get sideways and slide. We're going to go ahead and see if we can find an online session and, uh, yeah, do our thing. So here we go. T2K short loop. We got a red ring. Let's see. East Toge short loop. Everyone's probably sleeping in these lobbies. It's like three in the morning right now. We're just going to go ahead and join in here. 
super smooth build by the way you guys are gonna like this one for sure smooth and fast all right so we are in the building make way for the man himself we are here and we are ready to get sideways all right so let's go ahead and turn on the motion blur just a notch it seems to be a little choppy with a lot of motion blur so here we go also let me know what you guys think about the or let me, let me give me some feedback down below about the quality of the video um down below i did something a little different with today's video to hopefully make the quality a little bit better so i don't know if it worked but wrong we've been uploading videos in 1080p for a very long time i think it's time especially now that we have the new graphics card we're going to start uploading these videos in 1440p you know i don't know how long it's going to take to render this video my 1080p videos whether they're eight minutes long 15 minutes long they render in like five to ten minutes so it's pretty fast sometimes even faster than that so video quality is now going to be at 1440p man let me know what y'all think about that hopefully the quality reflects in the videos um but uh yeah just trying to improve the quality for you guys and i'm trying to try to take things a little bit slower with the tunes especially like i don't know i think about it when i'm like making today's video i'm just like man i think about all the videos like there's probably like at least over 500 to a thousand videos where i'm like rushing through the tune and i just want to say sorry to y'all for like doing that man i don't know why i couldn't control myself too much energy but i'm gonna try to calm things down take things a little bit slower for you guys and uh you know make things a little bit easier for people that are like new and trying to get it soon because like if you're new and you got to watch a video and the dude's like rushing through the video like goku fighting like you know uh piccolo or something just like at that god speed it's gonna be pretty frustrating so sorry about that things will be slowed down a little bit for you guys hope you guys enjoyed today's video you know with that being said this has been your boy ty skids once again playing cards for first online and today i showed you guys my nissan sylvia S13, 100 adhesion, stock engine, is smooth, godly, not just win. 100 adhesion, stock engine, ultra intro setup, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed. Peace.